saw some people, then they come here with uh, leg chains. Yes, sir. I said, here, yeah, no, no. I cannot pray for you with leg chains. Hmm. You can remove it. They may not be happy. I don't care. Hmm. I can't pray for you with leg chains now. How will you come here with... Uh, I will, I will excuse you and tell you uh, hmm. we are we are sorry we don't do this one. I will cancel you. We don't do this one here. Hmm. If you want to worship God and 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 you want to be even be acceptable, yes, sir. Before God, you cannot be like this. Hmm. Say anything of what I don't know, but okay. let me talk. About the thing I know. Okay, sir. Sorry, sir. The thing I know is, uh, as a matter of fact, Celestial Church of Christ. It has been cancelled long time ago that we should not be calling it Baza. It's harvest sales. Harvest sales. But what is demonic about Baza? Baza looks no, more fancy. No, Baza. No, 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 no. Baza kind of. A stick of candle. A stick of candle. In the candle. market, then, should not be more than but 10 cover. I and bought, I go, no, that's 50 cobble. Yeah, 50 cobble. I, I, bought it, I bought it for... I was even the chairman of that. I was part and parcel of the people praying on those items. Hmm. Individual. Hmm. Not that I'm not part of... I'm part and parcel of it. Not yeah. that somebody... Even, yeah. I bought it 137,000 naira. Hmm. Then... That's a lot of money, sir. 1994. That's a whole lot of money. So, not that I was stupid, mm. but God did wonders thereafter. God showed up, did wonders for me thereafter. So, when I came in, I thank God that He sent me to Celestial Church of Christ. Mm. I've told you several, I have been an occult man or Babalawo because I love things that are practical. But don't tell me you pray, 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 pray for me. Uh, I don't see any sign. I used to, uh, mm. yeah. But where you bring, you, you bring water, you bring uh, uh, fruits, you pray on it, and somebody will eat it and get healed, or uh, drink the water and get healed instant or gradually. Something somebody has been battling for years. Earlier. Then you are telling me. You are telling me. You want me to know things? Yeah. Malika. Oh. That uh, 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 the Shango post, uh, they, they brought something to the, onto the field. Uh, why now? Why? Why? That's why should this call. man continue to embarrass himself and embarrass uh, the Sultana or whatever he's putting up? It's a white, white Sultana. So it's a white Sultana. So at that level, so the trampoline, well, uh, that uh, somebody hijacked uh, a hack. Yeah, they Whatever hack, they yeah, like, they hacked, they, anybody say, they, they, uh, they didn't hack anything. They hack no nothing. I was saying that maybe the man wants war and fear. Hmm. Simple as ABC. You know, President maybe, Donald Trump. Maybe God wanted to use him for, the, for Israel and the Jews. The people of God and the nation of God. A lot of Africans in the diaspora are afraid of Donald Trump. That they have started panicking. Uh, they should, come, they should calling, come back to their country. If that is the case, they should come back to their country. But the country is not even okay for them. Uh, that, let's the let's make it okay. <laughs> by, by doing the needful. Pray, then advise the president, pray for the president, pray for the nation, advise the president through social media. This through social media gets to them now. Why can't we be using that as a medium to advise? I have given one advice now. I've given it before to some... Let's do something. We have been criticizing. People have been criticizing and causing them. What have, what have we achieved through that? Is it not pain and more pain and more pain? Then let's change strategy. Pray for them. Like the Bible says, if it's possible, let's be at peace with our people. If it's possible, that's Romans 12. If it's possible, let us be at peace with our people. Hmm. So let's show love. Love. Let's show love. Let the lead that is suffering pray to God for the peace of the nation and pray to the, to the leader, for the leaders. And let the leaders, through their prayers to the leaders may have compassion. Let the leaders know, uh, go through their conscience.
let us live. He himself let the poor breathe. But the poor are now trying to sneeze. They can't even breathe. They can't, they can't even, I mean. We thank God that breathing, the air we breathe, is not mm. monetized. It's not dependent on any power government or any 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 rich man. <laughs> we will all have gone. So they will they will corner everything for themselves. So mm. that's the way that one is. So our harvest will come. So now we will be buying our rice now. So 15th of December 2024. So before going to the harvest, I want you to uh, help us with a very, very important issue. Ah. Uh, we'll come back. Yes, we are just running up. This issue is the issue of people coming to Celestia Church. And uh, because I was in the parish yesterday for something, for a prayer, and uh, I saw a young man, handsome guy, did his hair like a woman, and they put on chain, and was looking so beautiful. And you look at what is going on in the a world. Man. A man, yeah, a man, tall. And he came, he prayed in the men's circle. He did his hair like a only song. You know, and this is becoming a plenty, trend. a trend in the church, in spiritual, you know, when you go to a spiritual environment to go and pray to God, and you see this kind of, I saw a, a man that is on tattoo, he's doing all sort of terrible marks on his body, tattoo of scorpion, tattoo of all sort of terrible, and a man is now plating his hair, like a woman, that he has earring to his ears, and we're saying that, is there no, you as a member of the BOT side, is there no means? or a directive or a strategy whereby you can put it in all the churches, like a board, like an announcement, that men that are plating here are not allowed or should go and change their identity before they can come into the sanctuary. Well, do you need anybody, you need pastor to tell any shepherd that? You don't need pastor, talk less than any beauty. Hmm. I don't know beauty or pastor in cancer. Do they need? They, 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 is, that, is that the way the church is? Uh, is? No. Hmm. No. No, huh? no, because it's a spiritual church. Uh, yes, no. I saw some people, then they come here with uh, leg chains. Yes, sir. I said, here, yeah, no, no. I cannot pray for you with leg chains. Hmm. We are remove it. They may not be happy. I don't care. Hmm. I can't pray for you with leg chains now. How will you come here with... Uh, I, will, I will excuse you and tell you... <laughs> Mm. We are we are sorry. We don't do this one. I will cancel you. We don't do this one here. Mm. If you want to worship God, and 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 you want to be even be acceptable, yes, sir. Before God, you cannot be like this. Hmm. Hmm. Weaving your hair like women is not meant for men. Yes, sir. Of course, sir. Earrings. It's not meant for men. I'm so I'm surprised. I feel so bad. Even if you're a footballer, you have all the money to put a diamond in your whatever fashion you want to do. Even your nose. Remove, remove those things, put it in your pocket when you are in the church. Immediately you get out of the church, you can put it on. That's your cup of it, a cup of tea. But when you are before God, in the presence of God, please, mm. let's do something that is a uh, Edible. That is, uh, that is uh, acceptable before God. Hmm. That we make our prayers to be heard. Hmm. So that's the way I see that. So your harvest is coming. It's called Meshizedek Blessing 2024. Yeah. Why did you choose that title, Meshi Ah, uh, you, you, you see what follows now? Blessings. Yeah, blessings, yes. yes. Blessings, blessings. Blessings from Meshedek. Okay. You read your Bible very well. Okay. You know... Mekshedek is the king of Salem. And that means king, uh, king of peace. Okay. How do we have peace in a situation, so an economy that is hostile? It's, it's, a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a blessings because he blessed Abraham. Okay, sir. Mekshedek blessed Abraham. Abraham. He While blessed Abraham, Abraham was returning from a war he fought and conquered. And Abraham paid a tithe to him. Hmm. Mekshedek himself is of no generation. Mm -hmm. So he's Jesus Christ. Oh, in another dimension? No, no, it's Jesus Christ. Mm. Mm. It's Jesus Christ. Yeah. I understand, sir. So that's the way it is. Mm. So that's what 
this harvest is talking about. Yes. Harvest of blessing. Yes. So blessings from Mekshedek. So blessing from Mekshedek. That's the same team we used last year. That one was 2023. Yeah. Make sure blessings 2023. Oh. Make sure blessing 2024. And that's the way it will continue, God willing. Oh. So it's going to be a blessing. Service is meant for blessing. Blessing. Because when you organize service, okay, sir. you have to bless others with it. Praise the name of God. Come in, the cheerful giver to the church of God. And church of God too will be cheerful giver to the needy. That's the way it goes around. So that's why they say, what goes around, what goes around comes around. What goes around comes, comes around. around. I'm asking that, can you give the divisions of harvest and especially the aspect of bazaar? People are so confused. There are some churches that believe that bazaar is just to accumulate wealth. You can imagine now, in the situation where we have pastors that are now selling, they are selling fish. If a friend is now selling fish for 1.5 million, people come and buy fish and put it in their house, they're going to have money. Fish and uh, honey, there is secret there. 1.5 million, the smallest fish. If you catch the smallest fish for this harvest, 1.5 million. Yeah. Then the biggest one, and you can now also carry them to abroad, anywhere you come from. Your shop, you're going to eat these fishes. Yes. Also, your, your, your ministry, your ministry. you're going to eat it. Remember, Jesus did not only use bread. Mm. He, added he added fish mm. for the multitude. Mm. Why? Because anybody that you add, you use this fish in order to eat in your business center, your business will boom. Multiplication. Multiplication. It's going to multiply. And also, your church, you are a pastor, you need to come and feed them. You come and receive more souls. That is the secret. That's why Jesus now revealed the secret, the deeper things in the supernatural for me to bring out this pond for the partners to now succeed. Because I want my partners to be like me, to do more than I do. Physically, spiritually. So these fishes, ay, yeah, 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 yeah. Come and test these fishes. Come and test them. Remember, Jesus Christ use a fish in order to solve problems. That's financially. Because financial sickness, where you are now passing through, what is happening to your account? What is happening to your money? This fish is not only for blessings of a ministry. It's not only for blessing for business. It's not only for blessing for what political career. It's a blessing for all, all around. He's even selling 1,000 naira. He said if they come, they should bring 50,000, 30,000, 40,000, buy 1,000, and put it in their pillow, they're going to make money. You come back to the mountain, you will come back with something. You can now see what I am telling you. Watch the screen. The, the, the numbers are there. Call them. What will you come back with this in? After sowing seed onto, in your life. I will sow this seed upon in your life. Then you will now, what you're going to do, make sure, call the line and hear from them. And I will also tell you. Now, at least you will come with... 30,000 or 50,000 or as far as 100 about anyone you want to come but at least it's 30,000 50,000 100,000 come with that come with the envelope to the mountains to the mountains the Lord, the Lord said you will see me what I am going to do for you and the Lord surprised Abraham right in the mountain then I will give you back this one I will give you back this one that I will give to you. But after you taking this one, you will keep this one. You cannot use this one. Don't use this one. Keep it for three months. Keep it for three months. People will ask you, are you a money doubler? People ask you, are you a money doubler? They will ask you because in my father's house, there are many, many masters. Because your case is very urgent to be treated. I am going to attend to your case. So get ready. If your brother is here, foreigners, you can now go ahead and tell your brother, this one will be with you. This currency will be with you. I will give you this one. It will be with you for three months. Then this one will be with you. The first one that envelope will be with you. In, on the 2nd of December, you will come with it. So from Sunday to Saturday, then I will give you another one. Now on your lights. Then go and now watch out. People around you. 
will ask you, where do you go? So the answer has come. Your case is very urgent. Your case, that the delay, your me business, delay, expectation money, delay, that been delayed. You will surprise that what you ever did that you've seen, you will see speed. The speed that God has given to you, you will see speed, financial breakthrough. You will see it. So, these two, one for you, one will go with you, then you come and collect the other one. But when you are coming back, you come back with the envelope that I'm giving to you. You can use the money, your business, or anything. So, I have to pass this message to you. Brethren, call the numbers on the screen there because I am waiting for you right in the mountains on the 2nd December. He's even, he has even captured a land of Judah, the real land of Judah, the Bible, He's selling it for people now. Viewers all over the world, wherever you are, I am Prophet Jeremiah Motofui. It's time for you to now to get this wonderful actions and now there's no retreat no surrender for you to receive these blessings and god is good to bless you the time of favor has come and god of jeremiah never say goodbye he is ready for you to receive your blessings and this time the lion of tribe of judah need to go with you are you hearing me he need to go with you it's time for action no brother no sister in your dreams physically spiritually hey overcome them enough is enough thank you very much the hour has come for you to now overcome them. God of Jeremiah is going to now give you the grace to now overcome them. Come. Any demon, you being any animal in any form, whether you are a bird flying in the sky at night hour, bat, oh my God, enough is enough because it's time for power. Demonstration. The line of Tabo Judah is in me. You can see how they perceive me. They cannot do anything. The same way, once you now come over, go and get the oil and the perfume. Your life shall never ever remain the same. God is going to do something wonderful right now. They are waiting for somebody. The Lion of Tribe of Judah. Now it's time for you to receive these blessings. And the time for you to now get these blessings. They call that fish, uh, Peter's fish or something like that. Uh, a title or something like that. And then he has been selling all sorts of spiritual things. So now I'm going to bazaar. Is, 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 what is the purpose? Because I'm looking at somebody selling spiritual things. Um, it is only in bazaar I see those things who have been blessed that people use it as a trade with God. So uh, bazaar, whether somebody is selling feet to bring skin, I don't know. I don't want to say anything of what I don't know. But okay. let me talk about the thing I know. Okay, sir. Sorry, sir. The thing I know is, uh, as a matter of fact, Celestial Church of Christ, it has been cancelled long time ago that we should not be calling it Baza. It's harvest sales. Harvest sales. But what is demonic about Baza? Baza looks no, more fancy. No, Baza, no, 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 no. Baza kind of, is kind of uh, where people, where people compete Compete, you know, there are kinds of element of uh, of uh, competition, uh, element of pride, element of uh, of uh, is this arrogance. Is arrogance. This is what I am. So people may believe it as that, but Baza is not. If you go and look at the definition of Baza, I think you you get it right there. This is harvest sales. Hmm. Ojai Kori. Ojai Kori. Jabasa. if you go to the redefinition, go to Oswald Long or Longman. You go and check Basa. Longman dictionary or okay, Oswald dictionary. Uh -huh. You go and Basa. So you see that it doesn't have any spiritual connection with what we do. Okay. Though Anglican people, the Protestants and all of that have been using Basa because from where it emanated like from the United Kingdom and all that. That's where this church is emanated. So, but... From England? Uh, from, uh, yes, as a United Kingdom. So, all of these things. So, but for the harvest sales, yes. Something that is of 1,000 Naira, you can buy it 1 million Naira. That in the market, they buy it 1,000. You can buy it 1 million Naira. That... Not that because you are stupid or you are a fool. I too have bought a candle. 
That was 1994. Hmm. A, candle, a stick of candle. In the candle. market then, should not be more than 10 kobo. And then, well, no, that's 50 kobo. Yeah, 50 kobo. I, 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 bought it, I bought it for... I was even the chairman. Of that. I was part and parcel of the people praying on those items. Hmm. Individual. Hmm. Not that I'm not part of I'm part I'm part of it. Not yeah. that somebody even, yeah. I bought it 137,000 naira. Mm. Then. That's a lot of money, sir. 1994. That's a whole lot of money. So, not that I was stupid. Mm. But God did wonders thereafter. God showed up. Did wonders for me thereafter. So, you, you are using your resources to help the work of God in buying those things. Of prayers have been, see, the one we have here now, for over two months we have been praying on those things we sell. Don't they have a, is there in the altar there? Yeah, so some on the altar there, yeah. The altar, in the inner altar. In the altar, part. okay, so some in front. In the inner altar, okay. those we will sell. Hmm. Like perfume, this and that. Uh, Fruits? Uh, no, no, you can't keep fruit for that long. Okay. Perfume, uh, some other items. Honey, some other items. It's been there. Can do. It's been there. Receiving blessings, ecclesiastical well, blessings. It's not just there. We, we, during the week, we bring them out, we pray on them, we return them to the altar. That's what we do for over three months now. Melika. Hmm. Okay. And now, harvest. All this, uh, somebody invited uh, Pasuma, a uh, portable or whatever they invite during the harvest period. We don't do that here. What we do is, night, seven days before that, that will end, that harvest morning, we are on vigil here. Every day vigil, seven days vigil, till the morning of the harvest. Mm -hmm. That's what we do here. We are not interested in all those. Jamboree? Uh, Friday. Geek, uh, night or whatever. They we call. bring his Saint Janet or Pasuma right. or Potibu. That's not what I met in Celeste. Or Sashino Pitas or. I'm an old school. Hmm. So, and that's what I want to keep to. That's what I want to keep to. So. The old school tradition. Uh, that's what I want to keep I to. I want Uncoing Bani. That's what I want to keep to. That's a fantastic one. Sir. That's what I want to keep to. That's why we're talking about the tenants. That tenants should be adhered to. That's what I want to do. Mm. And that's what I want to be adhering to. Mm. Uh, this uh, spraying money. And you cannot come inside here and be spraying money. Mm. Even during harvest or any event. No, you can't do that. We won't allow that. That's good. That is, that is evil. Malika. It's abomination in that's the house good. of God. Even it's inside this constitution. Yeah. Inside. That you cannot spray money. Yeah, it's in the blue book. In the blue book. It's inside our uh, celestial church constitution. So. Yes, it's in the blue book. So, the blue book. Uh, but many people, 99% of churches are spraying whatever they, because carving has become party. Even they are even taking wine, they are taking. No, alcohol. forget about wine. I'm not even interested in that. Uh, uh, <clears throat> anybody doing that know that is is uh, is uh, practicing evil. He said, annual harvest thanksgiving service. It is also laid down that each parish of the Celestial Church of Christ shall annually observe the harvest by holding harvest thanksgiving service, followed by harvest sales. Yes. This will be celebrated in two parts. What do they call it? Harvest sales. Harvest sales. You just Barsana. call it. It's on page 32 of the Blue Book. He said, juvenile and adults. The juvenile harvest will be celebrated by all parishes on the first Sunday in the so June we know month. That. Let's, let's, let me share page 36. Okay, sir. For if they have not seen this, aha, uh -huh, that's it now. Page thirty six. Yes, sir. During short services. Yes, sir. During short services, the utmost solemnity and attention. Say, during short services, the utmost solemnity and attention shall be observed. All mannerism that may militate against this, such as gossip, side talk, or pacing of currency news, 
or members of the choir in appreciation of their music shall be totally avoided. Jesus Christ. So, but why are they not reading all this? Uh, this I don't movie, know. It's, 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 this is the most holy. Is the way is the way people want to worship their God. So if you are passionate about the church you are worshiping, you want to know everything about that church. Hmm. So when I came in, I thank God that He sent me to select the Church of Christ. Hmm. I've told you several. I have been an occult man or babalawo because I love things that are practical. Don't tell me you pray, 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 pray for me. Uh, I don't see any sign. I you tell you. Hmm. Yeah. But where you bring you you bring water. You bring uh, uh, fruits, you pray on it, and somebody will eat it and get healed, or uh, drink the water and get healed, instant or gradually. Something somebody has been battling for years. Earlier. Then you are telling me. You are telling me. You are telling me things. Yeah. You want me to know things? Yeah. Malika. Hmm. Is a practical, you are, spiritual you are telling experiment, me this. experiment. So by the time you 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 telling me, uh, 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 pray 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 believe 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 days believe. prayer believe 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 God yes. is not that like that. Seventy days fasting and prayer. So I thank God though for God sending me to Celestial Church. Since the time I joined this church, I've never meddled into fetish. Hmm. Or done anything that is contrary Occultic. to the ways of Jesus Christ. Hmm. I, I mean, as seeking another uh, help from any power of God or goddess or anything or using anything fetish. I don't do it and I will never do it. Amen. I swear by the name of the Almighty God and by the words of this holy book. Amen. Amen. So and I do I cannot use uh, I cannot use uh, 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 manipulation to be bringing people to church because a lot of manipulation you can use like awaru, afaru. For, no, I'm not even talking about <laughs> fetish. That's so I've got, that one is categorized as a, there are other man, many manipulation that people uh, we we say okay uh, come and do this work uh, come and do that work come and do this work. Uh, do this one for you. They that I can't do that. It, well, it's not about work, work, work. It's about faith and prayer. Mm. Mm. It's about faith and prayer. Mm. So that's what I will say about that. Yes, I will call you. We want you to just address Nigeria on a very last note. This is the end of the year. Uh, you've been able to speak about the church, the, 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 the harvest, and the beauty of uh, have a sense and the spirituality of bazaar and all that. But how do you think Nigeria should end the year? This is the end of the year. How do you think you should prepare for Christmas uh, in a very hostile economic season? Okay. What we need to do is let's change our ways and pray. And love, uh, and love our neighbors as well as us. So what do you think you can do unto others? To do unto yourself. It's what you do unto others. So let the lead Pray for the leaders and let the leaders have compassion on the lead. So that's what I will say. Let the lead pray, pray for, for the, the leaders. leaders and let, and the, let leaders the leaders have compassion, compassion for, the lead. for the lead. But do you think then that's showing you love? Okay, sir. That's showing you love. And uh, let's pray. But what about food for the other, other people to eat this Christmas? No, to I've, buy I've said what I need to, to say. To all of those things, all of those things, they are encapsulated inside all that we have said. Mm. So they, we know where the trouble is. So let us pray and show love. Let the let show love by praying for the leaders. And let the leaders show love by having compassion on the lead. That, okay, these people are suffering. What can we do? Let's do this. You see, something that irritates me most, to be sincere, if Malika. President Tinubu will be hearing this, that, why? Though I know politicians, they have some gimmicks and strategy to popularize the, 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 the majority so that the majority will come to them to beg for food so that when election comes, they give them peanuts so that go and vote for me. So that's the, that's the thing they do. But you see, God 
is merciful. Mm. Merciful to the leaders and merciful to the led, to the, led, to the populace. Mm. Massive to the leaders, allow them to get there. Even if anybody manipulated that next chairman, neck officer, neck anybody, if God doesn't even want you to be there, he can make you die before that uh, before that thing is announced. Oh, pardon me. The British elevates the governor, calling me, is it Kogi? Yes, of course. Well, yeah, 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 do. Uh -huh. So, why, why, why we like this? Why can't we have compassion on the lead on the populace? So that's why we need to pray for our leaders, not to criticize and be cursing them. We should forget all this cursing line. Criticism, let's do something. We have been criticizing, people have been criticizing and cursing them. What have, what have we achieved through that? Is it not pain and more pain and more pain? Then let's change strategy. Pray for them. Like the Bible says, if it's possible, let's be at peace with all people. If it's possible, that's Romans 12. If it's possible, let us be at peace with all people. Mm. So let's show love. Love. Let's show love. Let the lead that is suffering pray to God for the peace of the nation and pray to the, to the lead, for the leaders. And let the leaders, through their prayers too, the leaders may have compassion. Let the leaders know, uh, go through their conscience and know that this suffering is not manipulated. It's not, it's not a drama. It's not a, it's not a plan. It is real. Then let them show compassion mm. on the populace, on the light. So that God will now start having mercy upon us again. Like what we read from uh, uh, Isaiah 26, from verse, uh, from verse uh, 16 to 20. So that's the way it is. So that's the way it is. So God, if we can do that, God may in his infinite mercy come to our aid and rearrange certain things in the heart. Rearrange certain things in the heart of our leaders by touching them. And things may not follow the same pattern as they have been following. We have to pray for the nation. Pray for the leaders. And pray that the leader will have compassion on us as the lead. Things may change. But when you start cursing, 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 criticizing, well, where will that one lead? Where has it led us? So we need a change of strategy. You have been going one way and it's not helping us. Let's change course and redirect our, 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 our journey. So that's what I will say. But... If things goes on like this we are doing, <clears throat> I don't see any hope in the future of this country. But at the end of the day, like we read in that Isaiah 26, from verse 16 to 20, God will intervene. God will intervene. At a point, God will intervene. Whether we like it or not, God will intervene. Oh. Let us do the new I won't leave here without asking the question. I won't forgive myself. I don't ask you. Yesterday, President Donald Trump emerged as the president of the United States of America. Before he came in, there have been different prophecy. People saying that, oh, it's Hillary Clinton. Uh, no, sorry, it's Kamala Harris. I mean, two famous men of God said, one in Sele, one in the Pentecostal. But what I want to say is that after the man said that Hillary, uh, Kamala is going to win, not take and stop it in November 3, and on November 5, Donald Trump became the president. He now said that they hack, that because they hacked the, 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 the vote, they hacked the computers, that it was coming in 50, 40, 10, 8, that it was dropping, and that even is because Donald Trump wants to build a golf course in North Korea, he has business with Kim Un John, the president, that he wants to create a big hotel there, and because he's also a friend of Putin, of Russia, that most of the countries that are destroyed under the war, his company is going to raise it. He gave a lot of reason, I mean, because the other time when GLO, when African coordination had problems, he said the witches of Nigeria stop it. The other time in France and Argentina, when Nigeria won, instead of France that he predicted, he said it was the, it was the referee that did deals, and that because they found one ointment that they want to use to make electric car in Argentina, that's why they shifted it, and the, that the poison five 
members of the, of, 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 of the front. Sir, what did you see to this kind of prediction? Does God change when things like this happen? You know, I, I don't like going into all of these things. I'm very sorry, sir. I'm very sorry, sir. If you think all of this is none of my business, with all the, these people that are, uh, uh, it's prediction now, it's not prophecy. It's a revelation to uh, the book. So if it's revelation, if God said, we have said it the last time, that if somebody said uh, <clears throat> Nigeria will win, it's already, the cup is already in Abuja. Yes, sir. So, and he didn't win. He didn't win. The person should have kept quiet. I've said it the other time. Rather than re-embarrassing yourself. So, I said, I don't want to get involved in all this. Then, uh, yeah, 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 uh, that wishes. Yeah. Can God say something will happen? It's wishes that we say to in our Why now? Said, what you have said is that, well, I am human. God can change anything at any given time. And if I give a 10 a prediction, whatever it is, and three or four is not coming as it is, and it's only six or seven that came to pass, well, as a human being, I cannot know it all. So that's it. Because God, in the Navy, Jonah was sent there. Yes, sir. And Jonah knew what God can do. In the day, the priest, he said that he will now change his way. He won't do what he, and they would call him fake prophet. Hmm. Use that. And if God, say, God said in Ezekiel that if I say, uh, 33, if I say somebody will die because of his evil works, and the person change, hmm. he said he will not die. And if I say somebody will live because of good sins, and he started committing sin from that statement, then he will die. Many things like that. So that uh, 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 the shame go post, uh, they, they brought something to the, onto the field. Uh, why now? Why? Why? That's why should world this court. man continue to embarrass himself? I embarrass uh, the sultana or whatever he's putting on. It's a white, white sultana. I say white sultana. So at uh, that level, so the trample, well, uh, that uh, somebody a uh, jack a hack. Yeah, they Whatever hack, they like, yeah, they hack anybody the, say, they, they, they didn't hack anything. They hack no nothing. I was saying that maybe they the man won square and fear. Yeah. Simple as ABC. You know, President maybe, Trump, maybe God wanted to use him for, the, for Israel and the Jews. Okay, sir. Mm. Because you know, do, uh, uh, we know what, uh, yeah. what Israel is going through now. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. In the hand you know, of you know, you know, the Palestinian uh, region. So Palestinian. You know what they, yeah. And you know, you know, Donald Trump is so committed to them. Yeah, it's an Orthodox Christian. Apart from that, he took them to from where they are? To he Jerusalem. To Jerusalem. There is their capital. Yes, sir. It's John Trump at his time. You know, he closed his two eyes to support Israel and the Jews. Biden opened one eye and closed one eye to support Israel and the Jews. But him, Biden, I said, open one eye, close one eye to support the Jews and Israel. Mm. But Donald Trump, he closed two eyes. He doesn't see any distraction. The one he has focused on, Israel and Jews, before he closed his eyes, is what he want to, he want to, he want to satisfy. So, <laughs> and you know, Israel is a nation of God. Yes, sir. And the Jews are the people of God. So, that's the way we are. That's why, this is the Bible we are carrying. It's the Bible that said it. I'm not the one who said it. And that's where I stand. I stand with Israel and the Jews. I'm sorry to say this. I stand with people of God and the nation of God. A lot of Africans in the diaspora are afraid of Donald Trump. That ah, um, ali, wa, wali, um, agba, we, wa. They have started panicking. Uh, they should, come, they they should come back to their country. If that is the case, they should come back to their country. But the country is not even okay for them. Uh, that, let's the let's economy. make it okay. <laughs> by, by doing the needful. Pray, then... Advise the president, pray for the president, pray for the nation, advise the president through social media. This through social media gets to them now. Why can't we be using that as a medium to advise? I have given one advice now. I've given it before to some this NYC, NYC, I mean, what do you call them? Yes, people? National Youth. Instead Service of Corps. them offices, you can use them as teachers, then farm settlement. 80%, 85% of them, the others within each state that you post to each state, For administrative 80, 80, 85% to so the, so the farm. Then the remaining 15, 20, 15%, 15 
administration and uh, maybe doctors to help then create farms uh, smart Settlement. settlements let there be light if there's no electric uh, grid to the place national grid let, let, let them have uh, generators they can do that they do that now individuals do that that we service them then get a clinic for them so if it's beyond that mm. then they have a standby vehicle that can be taking them out in case of emergency use that we have money to do that the they will be generating the money 12, 50 times than what they will consume that's a profit I understand. And it will feed the nation. So why do you just put them in offices doing nothing, wasting time? They are gambadating all around with their uniform. What are they doing there? So that's an advice. Let's use social media to advise the government. I help the government. Not criticizing or causing them. That's what I will say, Sha. Because people may not agree with, because you see some fanatics now, when they see this interview, they will say all, all of what they like. They, 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 they have the right to say it, but that's the way I've seen it. So, what is your word of congratulations to President Donald Trump? Do you have anything to say to him? I say big congratulations okay, to Trump Please for sir. standing with the people of God and the nation of God. I want to thank you so much, sir, for the honor of uh, giving us your time and uh, giving us direction for spiritual purpose and uh, allowing us to have an insight into what God wants for us for the year at the end of the year 2024 and especially an insight into 2025 uh, I want to appreciate our father in the Lord Prophet Emmanuel Abionu Shoyemi uh, his church is having its second year anniversary on the 15th of December, Sunday 15th of December and it's going to be a harvest of a blessing uh, accordingly Ms. Ms. the King of Salem uh, this is Ms. 2024 and uh, we're going to have a whole Mid lot of... Blessings 2024. Blessings 2024. Mid Blessings 2024. Mid Blessings 2024. So, uh, you come, come one, come all. You come one, come rejoice all. Rejoice with us and, and come have and your rejoice. blessings. Come and rejoice, come and have your blessings. There's going to be uh, harvest sales in terms of spiritual items that you are going to use to trade with God and God is going to open your barn. It's going to bring a lot of blessings and uh, God is going to change your business in a dynamic exactly. way. And you are going to be so shocked that you won't believe it. If only you can have the patience, the temperament to come and celebrate with uh, this great church. You are seeing the name scrolling there. And any of you that want to speak with the prophet, Emmanuel Shoyemi, the phone numbers are scrolling on the screen. You can reach out to him. You can consult in terms of spiritual guidance as a celestial or any member of the Christian community, you oh, want yes. to get direction, yes. you want to get anything I'll from say God. Alone. Anyone, yes. anyone. Uh, the, the, the grace, the grace is for every member of the Christian community. You are Catholic, you are Pentecostal, uh, you are you are Methodist. Even if you are Muslim, uh, there is nothing bad in getting a direction for your life, and God is going to show you how you're going to go about it. Uh, you will be lucky if you can't reach Him. You can drop your voice notes on the WhatsApp and the prophet will reach out back to you. Uh, till the next time, we're going to have this golden opportunity again to meet Prophet Imale Shemi. We want you to please be very careful of your church. Check very well where you worship. Ask yourself. Find out. Do a soul searching so that you can be saved because the book of the Bible says you shall know the truth and the truth shall surely Set, set you free. free. Yeah, that is John 8, 32. Always seek for the truth. Always establish it and be free. And God will make you free in totally in Jesus' Amen. name. Thank you. God bless you. Merry Christmas in advance.